Hey everyone, Aria Labs here with a blog to watch. Please subscribe to our videos on YouTube and like this video if you find it useful. Also hit on the bell to be notified of our upcoming videos. This is a review of the Louis Monet Memoris. This is one of the 18 karat white gold versions of the Memoris. And the term Memoris, which sounds like memory, has to do with the fact that long ago, the man Louis Monet himself, when he was around, um, I believe created the chronograph. There's a little bit of controversy as to who exactly created the chronograph. Um, Louis Monet believes that it was him, the brand today believes it was him, and they actually purchased the chronograph in question at auction, so they have it in themselves. Apparently there was one made or very few made, but there is one out there. It looks surprisingly modern. It's obviously a, a pocket watch in style. And Louis Monet as a brand discovered this after the brand existed. So it was very interesting that they discovered this previously unknown chronograph that is really great for their brand. And there was a little bit of a fight between Louis Monet and uh, a guy named Ryusek uh, that uh, uh, Mont Blanc has made some watches for. In any event, chronographs are part of Louis Monet's authentic history and they wanted to celebrate that through a watch called the Memoris. Now what's interesting about this is it really focuses on the chronograph in a way that I think is um, unique. And, and that is that the chronograph complication, all the parts are visible on the dial. So the movement here is what they call the LM54 uh, automatic. And you can see on the back here, it looks like a standard automatic movement, uh, pretty nicely finished, nice looking rotor. But all of the open work on the dial uh, for the chronograph is something that usually you find on the back of the watch. So if you look closely there, you can see, first of all, the two subdials, and you see some of the, um, the assembly there, sort of the transfer and stuff like that. So here, so I'm gonna push the mono pusher, and you can see how the transmission works. And so now I've activated the chronograph. So it is a mono pusher, so one pusher to start, stop, and reset. And you have the, main, the central seconds hand, and then you have a 30 minute chronograph and then there's a running seconds. The time is displayed down here at nine o'clock in this actually quite legible dial, even though it's small, it's quite legible with those actually quite attractive little hands there with loom. Um, I think that as far as small dials go, this, this petite dial is, is relatively legible. The Memoris also comes in a few versions in titanium, I believe, covered with stones. The brand has created uh, multiple models. So let's put the watch on, see what, it's, what it looks like on the wrist. This watch is, like I said, about 46 millimeters wide in white gold, so it is a, a stately watch. I love that, uh, that sort of fleur-de-lis style logo uh, that they have there. That's, that's quite attractive. I have small wrists, so I'm guessing it is the smallest ring. The strap is actually quite nice, and you know, in the scheme of Louis Monet watches, this one is remarkably straightforward in understanding it. Some of their watches are, 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 are pretty intellectual, let's put it that way, in understanding um, what some of the themes are. They also have a lot of watches that focus on space. So they have watches with space materials and moon rocks and Mars rocks and a lot of cool stuff like that. Watches that get very, very exotic. If there's any way that I would de define uh, sort of the theme of Louis Monet watches is it's sort of it's traditional but, but very exotic, very interesting types of things they do. I, remember reviewing this brand when they first revitalized and they had a whole Jules Verne collection that was just really neat. They had a couple of those watches and I was really happy with them. The, the, the brand has evolved a little bit since then, but it's always had a very avant-garde character. Very, very, very old European luxury and style, but very avant-garde and interesting. You know, you always think that the person wearing a Louis Monet watch probably has a lot of interesting th things to say. Definitely some cool stories, for sure. So like I said, this one is an 18 karat white gold, about 46 millimeters wide. Um, it wears large for sure, but again, that's the whole point. And it's this interesting look at the chronograph mechanism. So we'll sort of take a look at it again here. The chronograph is running and I am going to push it again. And you can see that there was a little transfer there. Push it again. And I wouldn't just sort of cycle through the chronograph all the time, but if as sort of like a fidget watch, you're sort of looking at it, playing with it. There's that one pusher and you have to move your hands back and forth. This definitely satisfies as a good watch to play with to pass the time. And I guess it's true that a good watch should help you pass the time. So again, this is a Louis Monet Memoris, a very special exotic watch that celebrates not only the brand's own special relationship with the chronograph, but chronographs in general by bringing you all the open work there and all the mechanics right through the dial. This watch is limited to 60 pieces 
and the retail price is $59,900. You can see the full review on a block to watch. Thanks.